Hello boys and girls. Today we're going to be reading another story and this story is called The Parrot Tico Tango. The Parrot Tico Tango. And it's written by Anna Witt. Watch out, Tico Tango wants all the fruit in the forest for himself. Will anything make this fruit snatching parrot learn his lesson? We're going to find out. So the story, Tico, The Parrot Tico Tango, is written and illustrated by Anna Witt and sung by Brian Amador. Amador. Okay, let's get started. The Parrot Tico Tango had a round yellow mango, but it was quite as, but it wasn't as, wasn't quite as yellow as the lemon of Marcello. And Tico Tango knew that he had to have it too. So he took it. Okay, so Tico Tango is taking fruit from other animals. So he snatched the lemon from the sloth. And did you see that these words rhyme? Tango rhymes with mango. Tango, mango. And yellow and Marcello. Marcello, yellow, yellow, Marcello. And then you have new and two, new, two, new, two. The parrot, Tico Tango, had a round yellow mango and he carried it to his right, a lemon small and bright. When he spied Elena's fig, which was purple, sweet, and big. And Tico Tango knew he had to have it too. So he grabbed it. So Tico Tango took the, um, the fig from the monkey. I'm sorry. So this is the, um, the mango that he took. This is the fig that he took. He also had, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. He had a mango, he has a lemon, and he has a fig. So he has three fruits. The parrot, Tico Tango, had a round yellow mango. And he carried to his right a lemon small and bright. And on his left, a fig, which was purple, sweet, and big. And he noticed his friend Terry with a red, juicy cherry. And Tico Tango knew that he had to have it too. So he stole it. So he stole the cherry from his snake, from the snake friend. And now the snake is crying. See the tear coming out of his eye? He's sad because Tico Tango took his red cherry. And it's not nice to take people's things because it makes them sad. The parrot Tico Tango had a round yellow mango. He carried it to his right. A lemon small and bright. And on his left, a fig, which was purple, sweet, and big. And on his back from Terry, a red juicy cherry. And he saw Mar uh -oh. and he saw Marina munch on a green grape bunch. And Tico Tango knew he had to have it too. So he snatched it. So he snatched the grapes from his friend who was a frog. See, the frog was munching on those grapes. And Tico Tango snatched them away from him, from her. The parrot Tico Tango had a round yellow mango, and we carried it to his right, a lemon small and bright. And on his left, a fig, which was purple, sweet, and big. And on his back from Terry, a red, juicy cherry. When he clutched the grapes, he helped and when he, and he clutched the grapes he helped and he put in his strong sharp foot. And when he spotted Pal Soraya, the deep orange papaya. And Tico Tango knew he had to have it too. So he seized it. And seize means to take it away. So Tico Tango took away Soraya's papaya. 
and papaya is a fruit. It looks just like this. The parrot Tico Tango had a round yellow mango. He carried it to his right, a lemon small and bright, and on his left a fig, which was purple, sweet, and big. And on his back from Terry, a red juicy cherry. And he clutched the grapes held put in his strong, sharp foot. And in his other foot, he held the papaya he, he had smelled. And when he saw his good friend Nate with a tiny brown date. And Tico Tango knew he had to have it too. So here's Nate. The iguana, I think it's the iguana, with a date. And the date is a fruit and it's brown. So he opened his beak wide to fit it deep inside when. Crash! Down came the mango, down came the lemon, down came the fig, down came the cherry, down came the grapes, and down came the papaya. Now the parrot Tico Tango didn't even have his mango, but his friends thought, what a treat. All that fruit they had to eat. They took the fruit he stole and they put it in a bowl. They washed it and sliced it. They peeled it and diced and they diced it. Tico Tango felt contrite. He knew he had to put things right. And contrite means he's, I mean, he felt bad. Tico Tango felt bad bad because he had stole all the fruit. He felt bad. He wanted to make things right with his friends because he had stolen all their fruit. As you see, Tico Tango is crying. Remember who was crying in the story? Who else was crying? Yes, the snake was crying. He was crying tears because Tico Tango had stolen his cherry. Please forgive me, I feel bad that I took the fruit you had. And the parrot Tico Tango begged for just one piece of mango. His friends were quite divided, but soon they all decided he deserved another chance. They would make the parrot dance. If you teach us all to tango, you can have a piece of mango. So his friends want him to dance for them, to show them how to tango, which is a dance. Then they would give him a piece of mango. And Tico Tango knew that he had to have it too. So he danced for it. The end. Did you enjoy that story? I think it was a nice story to read. Because they had, they had so many rhyming words. Did you notice all the rhyming words in the story? Like tango and mango, or papaya and soraya, or cherry and terry, or yellow and marcello. Can you think of any other rhyming words in the story? I can't wait to hear them. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.